Hey, I'm Joyce from Crossmint, a suite of developer tools that allow companies to bring their apps, projects, and agents on chain. We received a sponsorship from Cognition Labs to use Devin in an open source project that we maintain called GOAT. GOAT is a library of tools for AI agents to leverage blockchain primitives such as wallets, stablecoins, and other assets for financial use cases. GOAT has dozens of awesome human contributors, and our goal with Devin is to help them produce 10 times more by allowing them to focus on high-level integration specs and validation, while Devin does the more tedious dev work of building the integrations. And it's been going great! In just the past few days, Devin has already become the largest individual contributor in this repository, building two to three tools a day. Today, we'll show Devin adding a new tool inside the library that allows for agents to scan for data on the Ethereum blockchain. Here, I've input my prompt, and I'm just going to enter, and Devin can get started. All right, so as you can see here, we now have a PR made by Devin. Let's just go over to the repo to make sure that the PR is actually there. And it is. It was committed nine minutes ago. Now, where we've been really impressed with Devin is the fact that it's able to take really vague instructions like this one here and browse through the web and try to look for relevant API documentation. We're also really impressed by the fact that Devin is able to look through previous code and previous implementation to make sure that it stays within the structure of the code base. And we also really like that you're able to follow along with Devin as it does this thing either live or you're able to replay it after it's done. Now, where it gets a little confused is when it runs into CICD errors. As you can see here, when it's making a PR, it did have to retry two times, but this is still something that we're trying to teach it better. Devin works best when it's put in the code base with a very well-defined structure like GOAT, and also with more specific prompt instructions, like what you tell a new team member when you're onboarding them onto your engineering team. We've had a great time working with Devin, and we're also super excited to see how Devin can help open source organizations more sustainably maintain their projects.